Guys, how are you? Welcome to COD Stage 2. Uh, congratulations once again on passing your trial. Very exciting stuff. Uh, I want to take a couple of minutes to talk to you about personal finance and what we refer to as budgeting. Obviously, for any business, the key is to become profitable and to make more money than you spend. So obviously, hitting that break even, hitting, hitting that level of profitability is very important. The basic equation is obviously revenue, less expenses equals profit. And obviously, the more profit you make, the happier most people are. So the first thing we've got to do is work out where your break even is. Now, you might be asking me, what is a break even? Uh, well, a break even to me is at the point where you become profitable. So the first thing you've got to work out is you've got to work out your budget, your personal spending. So if I show you this, what we've done before, is we've worked out our budget for the average person living in Dublin uh, in 2014. Okay, so most people in Dublin pay about 100 euros each week to rent. Uh, obviously, it depends if you live in a bigger apartment, if you live by yourself, if you live in a super flash place, your rent's going to be more expensive and therefore your performance has to be higher. So it's definitely something you should work towards, but my experience, my opinion would be to, at the start, keep it as low as you can. Uh, then you've also got things like travel. Obviously, you've got to get to and from the office every day, to and from the field, so they give you the opportunity to make money. And uh, that's quite important. Now, there are ways to save on travel. You can obviously buy value cards, things like leap cards, uh, oyster cards, that sort of stuff and you can get cheaper travel, and obviously the cheaper the travel, the more money you save, so on and so forth, it's quite important. Uh, next thing is your phone. It's very hard to run a business, to run a team, uh, in this day and age, right? a mobile phone, and obviously mobile phones cost money. Now, if you shop around and get a really good deal, you can go to lots of different providers and get great deals, obviously there's Tesco, there's Three, Meteor, uh, O2, Vodafone, whatever it is, but find the best deal and hook up on that one. I think 10 euros a week or 40 euros a month is pretty reasonable for a phone, and you should definitely get something for that sort of money. Uh, then obviously food, you got to feed yourself every day going to the field, a good sort of lunch, uh, lots of energy to get you ready for the field, help you keep going on to hit your goals, uh, maybe on a sector break, grab a coffee or um, I don't know, a can of coke or some of that, so it's important to have a few bob in your pocket for that. Then obviously you've got your household costs, things like your own uh, home bills, like groceries and stuff like that, you want to buy some food for at home, for cooking dinners, having breakfasts, maybe make it a packed lunch to save here from the normal food, uh, so I put 75 euros in there. So that means for the average person living in Dublin, their break even is 315 euros. Now, assuming you may want to go out once in a while or maybe buy a pack of cigarettes if you're a smoker, we're going to add an extra 100 euros on uh, to the stretch goal, which brings it to 415. And um, so, as you can see, that's the kind of cost. Smart goal is 315, stretch goal is 415. Next thing we've got to do is work out how many sales it takes to do that. So, what I've done is I'm looking at these sales here, these figures here, and let's say you're in the business four weeks, what you need to do is you need to work out the average amount of earnings you've made in each one of those four weeks, add them together, divide it by four. In this case, it's 368 euros and 52 cents. Then we want to work out the average number of sales you've done. Over the last four weeks, I have done uh, 42 sales, works out at 10.3 sales a week. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to divide my average earnings by my average number of sales, and I get the average fee paid on the average sale I do. So what I can now do is I can work out because it's 35.67 on average per sale, I can divide that into 315, and I find out that in order to hit my break even, I need to do nine sales, and if I want to hit my stretch target, I need to do 12 sales. So now, come Monday morning, I know what I'm required to do to make sure I'm not just profitable, but I can also afford a drink on Friday or Saturday night or both. So there you go. Real quick thing I'm budgeting for you. Hopefully it'll make sense to you. Remember, you don't have to set your goal if it's 415. You could make it 515. There's no limit to how many sales you can do. Thanks for listening. Have a great day.